Hey guys, so today I'm going to be filming a 50 random facts about me video. This year I kind of want to get a little bit more personal and instead of just doing like beauty and fashion videos, I also want to do some lifestyle videos. Way to kill my vibe, Sam. <laughs> and yeah, so um, this is going to be letting, telling you guys a little bit about me so that you guys can get to know me on a little bit more of a personal level. And yeah, I definitely want to do some videos with my family members. I already have a video plan to do with my dad. And um, yeah, I just want to get more personal with you guys so that you guys can get to know me better. And like, like I said, on a more personal level. So yeah, that is what I'm doing today. Let's get started. Actually, this video is more like 44 facts about me because I couldn't think of like six others. So I'm going to just go with it. Okay. So the first fact is I am a natural blonde. I was born blonde. I was born like bleached blonde, but then as I got older, darkened, I have gotten highlights once, but that is the only time I've ever colored my hair. I am a natural blonde. My next is that my passions are acting, makeup, and making videos. Those are my three things. I could do them for hours. Like I watch YouTube videos and, and Netflix, but that's not really a passion, but oh my gosh, what is it doing? Hold up. Yeah, so my passions are acting, makeup, and making videos. I had the flu for the first time about a week ago. Oh my gosh, I have to do this. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> I had to do that. Um, I am partnered with Style Hall on YouTube, which was like one of the things I got so excited about last year. Um, if you guys want a video about me talking about it, then give this a thumbs up. I love chick flicks like Titanic, The Notebook, Safe Haven, but I also have my other side where I just want to see stuff like get blown up. It's true. My parents are divorced, and that is one of the personal videos I wanted to make, like talking about it and kind of giving advice about it, but I don't know if my parents would want that information being on the internet, so I don't know. But I really want to make that video, but we'll see if I actually make it. <laughs> my favorite color is pink or black, so I have my girly side and I have my not girly side. I did competitive cheerleading for five years until my gym closed and I had to stop cheering because it was expensive and my gym closed and I was injured and I was just like, okay. And I was going into high school, so I was like, whatever, I'll just stop. I miss it so much, but that's okay. I'm currently a sophomore in high school. I have two pets currently, a dog named Sam, a cat named Coco, and I used to have a hamster named Bruce. My favorite TV shows are Pretty Little Liars, The Fosters, Dance Moms, Under the Dome, and Ravenswood and Carrie Diaries. I know they discontinued Carrie Diaries. I was so upset. Oh my gosh, I can't believe they canceled that. I actually feel like... Anna Sophia right now and with this hair. <laughs> anyway, those are my favorite shows. I miss the Carrie Diaries so much. That was my show. My favorite movies are The Faults in Our Stars, Mean Girls, and Pitch Perfect, and the Transformers series, even though I haven't seen the third one. No. Yes. No, I haven't seen the most recent one, but I've seen all the others. I was Winter Varsity Cheer Captain at my high school as a freshman, and this year I am captain as well for the winter season. I am a very picky eater. I grew up with a soy allergy, so I grew up being a picky eater, like not being able to eat that much food, so therefore now I am a very picky eater. <laughs> so it's not my fault and I, I have an excuse for being a picky eater because I grew up with this soy allergy. So my camera died and um, so I charged it and so I'm back now here like an hour later. Totally forgot, oh wait, <laughs> totally forgot I'm wearing a Snuggie right now, um, but it's really cold. <laughs> I'm really cold, so that's why I'm like wearing a snuggie. I'm just gonna keep it on because, you know, whatever. I'm just gonna continue where I left off. I wear glasses most of the time, but I also wear contacts. Now, I honestly never wear my contacts. I haven't worn my contacts in months, maybe a year. Like, I haven't worn them at all. Like, I either wear my glasses or nothing, which is really bad for my eyes, but I just don't have the energy in the morning put in contact so I just wear my glasses during class and then I take it off in between classes I don't know I'm just weird like that but yeah I was born in Arkansas so like some words I say are kind of like country but like I grew I moved here when I was like two years old so I don't really have much of an accent I really need and want a job I mean YouTube is kind of a job but it's not like gonna sustain me until I get a little more popular if I get more popular <laughs> Um, but yeah, I kind of really want to get another job. My birthday is June 19th, 1999, so I am 15, so I will be 16 this June, and I'm really excited. I have one sibling, which is an older brother. 
I hate school. I feel like it, we're not going to use half the stuff we learn, especially for me, because I know I want to do something in the art world, whether it's acting or YouTube or modeling or doing stuff like that. So honestly, I feel like half the stuff I learned in school is pointless, but I still do care a lot about school. I feel like it's important and I like getting good grades and working hard, but like, I just hate it. Like, I absolutely hate school, but I know it's necessary. So I just, I still work really hard. I love watching scary movies or like TV shows or anything scary, but normally when I watch it, I'm like covering my face. I don't watch it. And then I'm like, what's happening? What's happening? Because I'm too much of a wimp. <laughs> True story. I can't stand shots or needles or blood or anything like that. Like, oh, I can't do needles. Oh my God. I still cry when I get shots and I'm 15 years old. Like I can't do needles. Oh my gosh. I, oh. I can't do needles. They terrify me and they hurt and oh, I just can't do needles. Yeah, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm, mm -hmm. I'm, mm -hmm. I love Panera. They're like one of my favorite like food places. Um, I also love Chipotle. I am a single Pringle currently. Uh, one day I want to move to California, maybe go to college there, but just so that I can help to follow in my YouTube slash acting career. That has been my like dream since like seventh grade. So I really, really am determined to do that once I graduate high school. I do not get enough sleep. I'm literally always tired. Nine out of 10 times I'm watching Netflix, YouTube videos or sleeping. So yeah. So if you know me, like I don't get people who are like, you sleep too much or like, you're like, you can never get enough sleep. Like honestly, let's be real here. Sleep is like the most important thing in my life. Like that is my, <laughs> main thing because I would go crazy without my sleep and I like sleep so much like I will literally sleep stay in bed and sleep until like five o'clock on the weekends so yeah I am five seven so yeah I am pretty tall I'm uh, pretty average but I am pretty tall my biggest pet peeve is when people smack like a cow like when people chew with their mouth open it kills me I'm just like can you not like they're sitting here and I'm like, mm -hmm. I can't, I can't deal with people chewing with their mouth open. It drives me insane. I like holding fish. <laughs> this is the weirdest thing. Like I like touching fish because they're just like slimy and like cool. And I, I'm, I'm so weird. One of the scariest moments of my life was I was on this app with like um, reading these scary stories and stuff. And in the app, like in the story, it was like the power went out, blah, blah, blah. And then the power went out in my house and I was home alone and I was freaking out and I was wearing fuzzy socks. So I like went, I like ran downstairs and I slipped because <laughs> I was wearing fuzzy socks. It hurt so bad. But yeah, that was like the scariest moment of my life because it was like the power went out. She heard a noise. She went to the basement and then the power went out my house and I just was freaking out. But yeah, I totally fell on my butt. I wiped out fuzzy sock probs. <laughs> I love guys who send like cute good morning and good night texts. I think it's like the cutest thing. My favorite animal is the unicorn. It's true. I have a big and a little pillow pet of a unicorn. Those are my favorite animals. And dogs and cats. I mean, I love animals, but yeah, unicorns is my favorite. I love meeting new people and making new friends. I play the trumpet in marching band, but I am probably not doing band next year. My favorite quotes are, imperfection is beauty and the road to success is always under construction. I have a habit of picking my lips when I'm stressed or nervous. Like I will literally just like do this. So if you ever see my lips being all crusty, I'm sorry. It's normally when I'm stressed, I just pick it. It's just a habit and then it like scabs and I pick it again. And it's just when I get stressed, it's just one of those gross habits I do. But yeah, it's, ugh. I'm pretty sure I have arachnophobia. When it started when I found a spider alive in my double tea pancakes. And I had a like a huge spider crawl on my arms and I started like throwing my clothes off because I didn't know where it went. Um, yeah, I, oh, spiders <laughs> make me cry. They freak me out. Oh my gosh. Ugh, okay. I love my friends and f my friends and family. They mean the world to me. And I'm one of those people who I have a little group of like really, 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 really close friends. I'm one of those um, quality over quantity friends who like I, I'd rather have a small group of really good friends than like a big group of kind of friends 
And yeah, so I have my small group of friends that I'm like really close with and then I mean I have a few friends here and there that I don't talk to that much but that I'm so close with but I'm more of a small group type of friend person. It is my dream to make it big one day doing what I love while inspiring others. That is like my ultimate goal. I just want to do what I love and be able to inspire other people and other girls and get my story because honestly I've been through a lot at a young age and I really want to be able to share that story and inspire other people with it. So that is my goal in life. Now that is all of the facts I have right now. Um, yeah, I guess I'm just going to end this video. Okay, like my snuggie, he's falling. And it's bothering me. Alright guys, well that is it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And I really hope you guys enjoyed kind of getting to know a little bit more about me. And getting a little bit more personal and learning stuff about me. Um, make sure you give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Um, comment below any video requests that you have. And I will see y'all in my next video. Love you. Bye. Mwah.